Welcome everybody. Welcome to One Heart Meditation. Today is March the 2nd, 2021. Um, instead of the, the March 3rd gateway meditation, I would do this One Heart Meditation as though we were celebrating and welcoming in the March 3rd gateway energy. So let's all begin. Let's all begin by starting to tune inward. What I mean by that is just mentally start to let go of seeking attention outside. If you have your eyes open, then may I suggest that you close your eyes And if you are, so instead of listening for noises outside is to start to listen for noises that is within your body. Something may be set in intention to hear your own heartbeat. Something that is inside your body. So turn all your senses within and also pay attention to breathing. When you breathe, be very deliberate. Deliberately breathing in, taking your time to breathe in. And when you cannot breathe in anymore, then take your time while you're breathing out. And do this for a few more breaths to just using your own breath as a rhythm for you to tune into yourself. And use your breathing to relax you, to smooth out everything. Smooth out your energy. To relax your body. And when you feel your body starting to relax, then set the intention to shift your attention to your heart. Focus in on your heart. Try to feel your body as your heart beats. Feel where your heart is. Feel that gentle pumping and that rhythmic pumping of your heart. As so this is the first time you have ever noticed your heart beating. So try to synchronize the two. Try to notice your breathing as well as your heart's beating. You don't necessarily have to aim for having your heartbeat and your breathing to be the same rhythm. You most likely would be able to breathe much slower than your heart can beat. 
And that's absolutely perfect. As you tune into your heart, also set the intention that you want to connect with your soul through your heart. Allow your heart and your head to be aligned. And also align yourself with your solar plexus as well. Feel energy between your heart, your head, and your solar plexus. Have all those three major energy centers to kind of sync up with one another. Your heart is the seat of your soul. And your solar plexus is the seat of your entity or your earth soul. when you allow those centers to become aligned and synchronized. You are uniting your earth soul with your cosmic soul. Feel that column of energy that goes from your solar plexus up to your heart and then up to your head area and all the way beyond your head through the top of your skull where energetically you are linked to your higher self and your soul energetically so that the energetic parts of you is linked up with the physical parts of you. Allow yourself to feel what it feels like to be connected with all parts of you, the physical and the non-physical. And as you link up both the physical and the non-physical parts of you, You link up to everything that is around you as well, because everything exists in your consciousness as a sphere of energy that is around your physical body. The sphere of energy that even though you may not be able to see with your physical eyes, but it is how you connect with your environment, with the energy of earth, I mean, with the energy of other people or animals or plant lives around you. 
We are all simply energies. that are arranged in a unique way that expresses our energetic blueprints. And as you feel this first level of oneness in your heart, Set the intention that you want to connect with everyone that is on this call in this moment. And also in every moment in the future when other people even the future you connect with this meditation again you would be able to connect with this energy again and become one Feel the energy of everybody that is connected to this meditation in every moment of now. And expand this connection. Allow this connection to grow, this energetic connection to grow so that we get to be connected with more than just the people that are on this call in every moment of now, but also be connected to our friends, our loved ones, the people that we connect with in our daily lives, in each of our daily lives. and allow that to expand even further out so that it connects to all the people that is in the city that we're in. Imagine what it feels like to be connected with everyone, everything, every being that is in our cities. You're connecting with them through oneness. Because even though our bodies may be separate, but our energies are intermingled. There is no separation energetically. Energetically, we are all one. And the next time you breathe in, allow this energetic connection to grow even bigger. So that now we are 
connected with everyone that is in the same country that we are in, in this moment. Imagine everyone that is in the whole country that we are in, everything, every plant, every animal, every animal in the sea, all of the living beings that are on in the country that we're in in all the moments of now feel this connection And then with next breath in, allow this connection to grow even more so that now we are connected with everyone, every being, everything that is on earth in all the moments of now. It is a little different to be in connection with all beings that are on Mother Earth at this moment. We may not be able to recognize any one individual's energetic signature. But we get a sense of all the energies of beings on earth in this moment. And because we are connected to them, that we can if we choose to just be the observer and simply be the witness of everyone and every being of all they are doing, thinking feeling, creating in this moment and all the moments of now. And being the observer, being the witness It's a powerful position to be in. It allows you to influence what may or may not happen. without being tied down by judgments or expectations.
you what it feels like to be present to yourself and to all the beings on earth in this moment. Relax. Relax and simply be. Simply allow yourself to be in that neutral zone. Where you know beyond a reasonable doubt that you have everything that you need. that you have everything to be safe. Allow the world to simply unfold under the influence of your observation. When you are observing, you simply Sending out your preference, what you prefer to feel, to witness, and to observe without having any attachment to what may or may not happen. It is a great way to go through the day by simply being the observer. You're not trying to arm twist somebody to do the things that you want them to do. You're simply observing letting them know what is your preference without placing any obligation on them. Feel what it feels like to just observe. Be at ease. Be at peace.
and be happy as well. You're here to experience life, not suffer through it. When you are completely surrendered to this process of being the observer, when you have no more resistance, to simply observe. And you can choose you can choose to stay here continue to be the observer or you can choose to come back To your body. The choice is yours. And whatever your choice is, it's absolutely perfect and right. And should you want to choose to come back, to this moment in your body and you can start to start to take a few deep breaths without being too overly drawn out and allow these deep breaths to start to bring more energy into your body to bring more oxygen into your body. And then you can take the next step by trying to move your body just small motions as to make sure that your body is ready to come back to the room and then take one more deep breath and let it all go and when you're ready to come back to the room And open your eyes when you are ready. Thank you for joining me this evening. <laughs>